This is a Broadband Academy wire wrapping video. This is our mainframe that is located in the central office. It has two sides. One is called the horizontal side, which you have a horizontal block. And the other one is called the vertical side. And you can tell you have a vertical block. Each side has its own purpose. The purpose of the vertical block is a connection point to all your outside plant cables. Your outside plant cables are, are also connected with a surge protector or an arrestor that will eliminate any type of external surges uh, coming down through your actual uh, copper cable plant. This will allow this arrestor or fuse to get blown before it goes into any of our uh, central office equipment or any type of internet service um, equipment. What we have here is this connection point between the horizontal side which goes to the um, central office equipment to the vertical side which goes out to the subscriber or out outside plant. What I'm going to do is just show you different types of wire wrapping. Um, the wire wrapping consists of taking the actual uh, insulation off this cross connect cable and what you're doing is you're doing a physical termination between the horizontal side to the vertical side. In the central office this takes place um, usually your central office technician um, does this, but depending on uh, what type of environment, you know, any technician could also be doing this um, if they wear many or multiple hats within their company. So with that, this is what the internal uh, connection point of the actual uh, vertical block, which is connecting all these pins and these test points with this arrestor. So what happens when you pull an arrestor out, you actually open up the circuit that's going outside to the, to the outside plant. And this is what all the wire mapping looks for each individual conductor. This is a 100 pair uh, vertical block. And I'm just gonna give you a quick demonstration on how to strip the wires. So, here is your conductors. You have your tip and ring, your white blue and your blue white. This is a cross connect stripper and cutter. It'll do a, a couple different things. So what we do is we eye it up and we pull the actual insulation off. And this does a perfect job so we don't nick any of the conductor itself. And you want at least, you know, two inches of copper shown here. Just because you want to make sure you have a good connection because when people are uh, mucking around with the cabling in here, you want to make sure it doesn't break off your terminals and so forth like that. What we have, how we do this is, whatever your physical cable pair, you can go through your plant records and find that out and uh, um, where this termination point is going to take place. So with that, you have your conductor and you have your wire wrap tool. Your wire wrap tool will allow you to go onto the pins and twist those on, okay, until you can feel that it all comes out. Inside here you have a big hole and a little hole. The big hole is going to go over the poles and your little hole is where your actual um, conductor is going to go into. And you'll slide that all the way up to the insulation. Then you're going to find your location and put a little pressure on, and this is where your wire wrapping comes into play. You'll wire wrap that on. 
Then you do your next one. And if your conductor is bent, it doesn't want to go in there. And you can see that it's right up to the end. And slide that in like so. Put a little tension on, and you'll twist. And this is what it looks like. So you get your conductor in there, tip and ring terminated, and then from there, you would actually go over to your circuit ID and terminate that and that's where your connection point from your horizontal side to your outside plant cables on your vertical location and this is just a short demonstration of wire wrapping they do have special automatic wire wrap tools um, for our purposes we do all with the hands wire wrap tool now, you might have some question saying, what happens when you have to take a wire up? Well, this thing actually will do on and removal. You just take that off. And here you have a little hook that actually will remove that wire wrap. Like so. Alright, this concludes the wire wrapping video.